Hello, it's Mike Matthews. I'm wearing this wonderful sweater presented to me by Nick Rotola, who owns this Web3 gallery in New York City and Fifth Avenue, changing the world with what the metaverse is, Web 3.0 is. We all sort of get it bits and pieces. Now, I'm going to stand aside here slightly and show you a couple images of me at Nick's store on Fifth Avenue, but then me back in my hometown here in Tulsa, Oklahoma, broadcasting around the world with the very thing we're talking about, Web 3.0. How do we reach into the world with education, intelligence, knowledge? I've always been waiting for the day where we don't have to wait to package a four-year degree, but we can actually send out pieces of information instantly around the world. Maybe shout it from the rooftop, maybe be in a classroom, maybe be on the sidewalks, maybe be in a garden. Wherever you might imagine we could educate people, we can now do that. You know, I'm using a software package here called Beam, B-E-E-M, and I'm literally letting people anywhere around the world bring up their iPad or smartphone and putting me in their environment. It's a digital overlay of me in a message that I delivered. Now, that message, though, of an overlay, in an overlay, I should say, is really what the metaverse is. Meta, higher level, reaching around the world. So you and I have the privilege today as educators to educate everyone around the world. You know, I have witnessed Queen Elizabeth's funeral and they estimated that 4.1 billion people around the world saw it in one form or another. Could have been live, could have been on TV station, could have been streaming media, could have been on a replay on YouTube. Whatever the case may be, is we're finally understanding that over half the world, 4.1 billion people can watch one event. Now, that was all done with great production capabilities, but now today we can, as educators, get rid of the podium. And we can really go into every person's world and begin to educate people in fresh new ways. Imagine being on a rooftop giving a lecture. Imagine being in a garden and being relaxed because I believe education needs to be a lot more exciting, maybe not relaxing as much as exciting, but when I witness people like Anna Dreambrush painting things in virtual reality, I always have wondered, why can't algebra be that fun? Geometry, chemistry, biology. And I think it's time we can do that. The technological means are now possible to let those who truly want to educate the world to do exactly that. You know, it's easy to envision now billions of people being educated. My heart has always yearned when I knew that only 6 to 8% of the entire world has any form of post-high school education. When we have the means possible today, I want to give a hats off to Nick Rotola, who's proving it in New York City. He's a graduate of Oral Roberts University, but I believe there's a lot of other great educators, a lot of great other business people who can all work together to integrate the very things that could instantly educate the whole world. Again, stay tuned as we watch the metaverse unfold. You can use Web 3.0 if you want. You can use the terminology, uh, anything you can imagine, extended reality, immersive learning. But the reality is it's all integrated. The product I'm using and showing these clips on the left side integrates multiple technologies, but I don't need VR headsets anymore. I only need a smartphone, and I get to hear some of the greatest messages, the greatest lectures of all time in fresh new ways, maybe in someone's living room, maybe on the coffee table. Maybe again on somebody's rooftop or right there at a university. It's a fresh new day. Pay attention to what's happening with the metaverse.